Hello there guys and gals, the Welsh Hunter here, back with yet another 100% achievement and trophy guide and today we are going for a nice easy one in Bullet Beat. And this is a game developed by Turnox, published published by Zitalon, X Zitalon, sorry I butchered it the last time as well, my bad. But <laughs> it's available to you for just £4.19 or $4.99. Now, this is a rather fun, enjoyable, yet easy completion with only one achievement which may cause you a problem, or at least just a few retries. So as you can see then, this game plays like a shoot 'em up So we're going to go through 8.3 levels with you as a gun, sort of riding up through the levels, blasting all the enemies. And that's for 10 out of 12 achievements. The other two are for getting a 500 and 1000 combo, which level 6 will provide for us. But it is kind of similar to many games we have played in the past and the good news too is you can just simply play every level on casual and to be honest I didn't die once during it so it seems pretty hard to die on casual mode. So with that being said then we have already begun. So you've got two options then, go through the whole story in career mode or whatever it's called or endless mode. But really we are not going to be using endless mode, although it is rather fun. Now what you'll see me doing though is completing each and every single level. So this is an achievement guide with pretty much a full walkthrough. As for shooting, as you can see, simply press and hold A for continuous shooting. Move left and right with the left thumbstick of course and try to pick up as many power-ups as you can as we move on. While avoiding all the enemies and all of the shooting. Yes, it is that simple, but as I said, it is very enjoyable. And the music, bah, is such a banging epicness, I absolutely loved it. Really makes me want a few vodkas in a nightclub, to be honest. So there you go, level 1 is done, level 2 now is basically the same thing, not too bad again, you're just trying to avoid the shooting enemies, picking up all your power ups and continue to hold A to continuously shoot, it's not too bad, and you can get shot quite a number of times, it just does seem quite impossible to die on this mode.
Right then, so already on to level 4 out of level 8 then, within about 10 minutes or so. Now, the only reason I'm commenting on this one is basically there will be a... It's basically just like this brick wall of these little orange cubes, which we will need to try and get past later. It can be quite confusing, so we'll just go ahead and nip onto that bit now. So I'll see you in just a moment. So then, here now is the orange wall. Now for ages, basically what it'll do, it'll go away, uh, shoot these little bits of bullets at you, you, you just avoid them. And I thought you just had to get rid of absolutely everyone, but what it is, basically there's only one brick that you can actually hit. And you can tell when you're hitting that brick when there's like little bits of debris or something flying off it. And that's the only brick that you actually need to hit and destroy and then you can move on. But it took me about five, well, actually about ten minutes of um, figuring that out, to be honest. So as you can see now, just try and find the one. You've just seen the bits of debris flying off. So as soon as you figure out which, winner, uh, which one it is, just try and aim for that one, and then you can move on. So don't get confused like I did. <laughs>
So then, this is the level that we are getting the combo achievements on, and we get it at the end for basically fighting this big boss. Now, what he'll do is throw tons and tons of enemies at you, because what you need to do to finish it is hit buttons either side of him. He's basically trapped behind a barricade. So as long as you don't hit those buttons either side, he remains trapped, throwing enemies at you, but again, it's still pretty hard to die. Right then, so for the 500 combo, you should get this very easily, to be fair. Now, all you have to do is basically stay in the middle and obviously hit the enemies. Because you'll have these sort of big squares, which sort of break up into small squares eventually. Now, with that, of course, that is easier said than done. But make sure there is at least one enemy on screen in case the combo dies. Now, to be honest, for the 1000 combo, I did struggle, as have others, and that's because you get to a point where you become so powerful and you end up wiping out the barricade anyway with the power-up weapons, which can be very frustrating. Now, how I got it was, I'm not sure if it's a glitch or not, but at one point I got basically stuck at the bottom of the screen in the middle, unable to move apart from shooting my gun, but I was able to get enough health, etc. to finish it. So, be aware... You know, it'll take you maybe just once to do, or it could take you a few times. But again, the best advice I can give is just stay in the middle. Make sure you need to hit, hit those big buttons either side of the main red button. And hopefully you should be good to go. Of course, you can also do, do it on endless mode, but getting to level 34, 35 takes a while. And you may die a few times before then. So, you know, it just takes ages on endless mode. So hopefully, that's, sorry that's the best advice I can give, but hopefully you get it a lot quicker than I did. So you'll start off level 7 then with this like white ball or something attached to you. I don't know if it does anything, but you know, swinging them around and knocking the enemies out of the way is always fun, ain't it? <laughs>
So then now we've only got three levels left, which is just perfect. So for for this first one, you've got to hit this giant... Well, you basically got to kill just this giant rocket-looking thing on the left-hand side. Um, the last two levels can take its time a little bit, but again, it's just it's not too difficult at all. Still very fun, and the music is still unreal. So this bit then can seem like it's going to take ages, basically the space raider up top will shield itself so while you're still avoiding him, as soon, just keep your eyes focused on him though, as soon as he stops shielding and moves just try and kill him. This can seem like it's going to take a while but you'll get there eventually.
and finally for the last level then so what you have to do see that rocket that just come down that'll come down about four or five times and you have to aim for that every single time you have to aim for that so, and you'll see the point where it starts coming down so you'll have to it's basically a very repetitive bit every 30 to 40 seconds or so and you'll get to a point where the rocket sort of shoots down every four or five times to so sort of stay in the middle if you can try and hit him a couple of times um, obviously just, again this seems like it's going to be a bit trickier but again it's not too bad so it's always after you start rising up and there's a whole bunch of red squares on screen that is when the rocket will start shooting down it might take you about six or seven times of going through but you'll get it eventually and that will be that So that's it then guys and gals, I explode this guy, I get the full 1000, job done. Now again, hopefully you got the 1000 combo from level 6 or endless mode. If not, again, my best advice is to hit it on level 6 and just stay in the middle. You will get it eventually. But I do hope you enjoyed the fun game and the guide, hoping that helped of course. If it did, you know, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Also check me out on my social medias too, on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook and also Patreon. So if you check me out on any of those, thank you so much. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Big love.